Hi everyone, Nalzi here and it's time to continue The Last Door. Let's continue. We left off last week with finding a body. Oh god, what has happened here indeed. We found this body that says leave me alone. And uh, we found a letter which we read through. So, wait, did we read that one actually? What is that one? Dear Margaret, it has been days since Anthony left his office. I can hear him whisper angrily, frightfully, and it gets worse at night. Our service left a few days ago. Without their help and company, I am lost. I can barely walk out of bed, and not even the doctor will come here after his argument with Anthony. My husband has developed the horrible ability to break anyone's will. I do not know what to do. I do not have any strength left. I wish I could send you this letter. Your dear friend, Anna Beechworth. Okay. Okay. So here we have a corpse. Fantastic. Fantastic news. How are y'all doing? Uh, she's clutching a note. I have read this note. This is the one I've read. Okay, cool. I haven't slept. What is this? It's the hairpin. Yes. I haven't slept today. I went to bed and I couldn't sleep. I had music stuck in my head. Another letter. Oh, okay. I cannot go on. All is lost. Good movie. Uh, Robert Redford. Uh, let's have a look at this. It's a diary page. Okay. I cannot stand their stares. They watch me. They judge me. They despise me. I know they think I'm not worthy of this family, but who are they but dust and bones? A memory. Leave me. I do not need you. Leave me alone. As it says, leave me alone. Yes, indeed. The writing on the walls reads, read me alone. Who would have written such a thing? Well, potentially not her, because if she was in a wheelchair and she was unable to do that, then that's a bit of a, an, an odd one. If I click this, is this going to show me the letter again? Yeah, I don't want the letter. I don't need the letter. Is there anything in her address or drawer here? Oh, I didn't pick up the hairpin. Oops. Nothing of any interest. Okay, give me this uh, hairpin here, please. Fantastic, fantastic. Nothing on the... Wait, nothing on the chair? No. Let's go through here. Into this dark room! That's a great idea! Oh, it's filled with... What was that noise? Oh dear, it's filled with paintings. What we got here? A woman with strong features and dark hair. And that noise again. She has a bold look in her eyes. Okay, what about up here? A young Anthony. Okay. She looks like a woman... She looks like the woman in the bed. She's holding a baby. Could that be Anthony's child? Oh jeez. Oh jeez. This old man bears some resemblance to Anthony, but his countenance is marred by a severe, unsettling gaze. What? When I click them, it's making noises. That's strange. Again, a noise. This young woman, not yet in her 20s, stares defiantly back at me. A man with blonde hair. I feel as if I've seen him before. Oh, I'm crossing the room to see this one. A portrait of Anthony, standing beside a mounted wildcat or lynx. The paint looks fresher around the animal's head. Oh, really? What does that mean? Does that mean Anthony painted himself? So this one rang twice, right? What is that noise? Can I look at the window? There's a big raven perched outside the window, tapping on the glass with its beak. Okay, knock it off, raven. Throw a hairpin at raven. No, okay. Uh, right, okay, well, I don't think there's anything else I can really do in here, but uh, gaze upon these fascinating paintings. In the last video, people left me a uh, suggestion which is that uh, the painting in the hallway can be pressed again and uh, something happens so I'm going to go and have a look at that painting right now let's let's slowly go there I think it was all the way over this way wasn't it and then we'll go back to the uh, the latch I think we'll go back there that sounds like a good idea right over here we go hope everyone out there is doing good me how am I doing what well, I didn't sleep and I can feel... Hello, Ravens! Yes, I missed you. I can feel the sleep kind of coming on, if you know what I mean. I can feel me getting really tired. Ah! Yes! Good call, everyone! What is that? An old rosary. A cord of beads with a solid wooden crucifix. I'll take it. Good bloody shout, everyone. Uh, okay. Can we... Wait a minute. Where was the... Where was the girl who had the rosary? Where did she stay? In here? Can I put this crucifix on the wall? No. Can I put it in the hole? No. Okay. Um, can I pray? Help me. I want to pray. No, I can't pray. Empty bowl just to feed pets. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. What about this? 
a wash bin with some toiletries. How did I miss that before? And a mirror. Uh, hmm, nothing I can do though. I can maybe wash the cloth. No, okay. And nothing of interest in the drawers. No, of course not. That would be that would be too smart. Right, I'm gonna go back this time. I'm going to go to the room. This music is wonderful. I'm gonna go to the room next door to the one with the corpse in it. I don't know why I'm not calling the authorities at this moment. I believe there is some secret that um, I'm trying to keep from becoming public. I guess Anthony's my friend. We're a part of some sort of secret society. And I'm um, trying to keep that secret pu uh, private. But I don't know what it could be. But, you know, I wouldn't want to report a corpse to the cops. The coppers. Hairpin and latch? Yes. Using the hairpin, I managed to escape... Well, I don't know what that says actually, but I managed to open the latch anyway. Right, we've got lots of bottles, and that looks like a dead animal. A lynx mounted and stuffed. It's a fine work of taxidermy. I'm not a huge fan of taxidermy. Was that a hammer? A common hammer in good condition. I'll take it, thank you. What's that? A can of paint thinner? I'll take it. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. What's this? That's a door. Some sort of spoiled chemical product that smells strongly of vinegar. Okay, and what's over here? A few handwritten notes, okay. That goddamn cat. He meows every night. And it's for me, I know it. He's mocking me. He knows my secret, he knows. I will not let him ruin everything. I do not have any choice. I have to put an end to his miserable life, or better yet, I will blind him. You gabby, gabby lynx. He would not confess. No, not you. Um, uh, hmm. Oh, uh, well, that makes me worried about the poor cat. Uh, might have kicked the bucket, in all honesty. Uh, books that we can't do anything about. A map of the region of Sussex with markings drawn on its surface. We might come back to that. What's that above the door? Nothing we can look. Wait, what was that? Was something down here? No. Can. Hammer. Hammer can. Cloth. Oh, oh! What? I damped the cloth with some paint thinner. What? Oh, God, what am I going to do with that? Oh, God, I didn't mean to do that. I don't know what to do with wet cloth. Oh, that door's open now. Is that all that was? Okay, wait a minute. Let's go back in here then. Okay, can I go up these ladders? On top of the ladders, a trapdoor with a keyhole reinforced with gold. Okay. Up. Up to daisies. Right, so can you get up there? Trapdoor's locked. I'll need to find a key. Can we hammer it? Can we hammer the lock? Like, like so. No. Hmm, okay. Can we use the crucifix on the lock to jimmy it? No, we can't. Okay. What about out the window? What's out there? No, oh, that's back in here. Right, okay. Gotcha. Okay, hmm. Well, now I'm a bit stuck, actually. This is where it gets tough. Wet cloth. What can I use a wet cloth? A hammer, a wet cloth, and some rosaries. What other mysteries are left? So there's the mystery of the room with the rosaries in it, right? This room has, yeah, the old, the old corpse in it, grand stuff. Uh, let's go back this way. What could we be missing here? Can we get in here? No, that's jammed. Okay. It's stuck. It won't open. Can I use a hammer on it? No. Can I use a rosary on it? Rosary. No. Okay. Fine. Okay, wait a minute. Can I use the wet cloth on the rosary? No. Can I use a hammer on the rosary? No. Damn. Okay. I thought I was onto something there. But I, uh, I, I wasn't. I was onto nothing. I was, uh, I was actually uh, on the opposite of nothing, uh, which is everything, I guess. I don't know what I'm talking about, sorry. I'm, I get a little, I'm a little loopy from the lack of sleep, but it's a good thing, kind of, because I'm alert. Right, so here we are. It's time to do the dishes. No, okay. Uh, nothing else is in here to be looking at. I, I want to go to the... I, I guess it's the, the maid's room. I think there's something in here to do. Like, we've got a couple, of, a couple of questions. Like, what is this hole about? You know? A tiny dark hole in the wall. Yeah, what's that about? We can't do anything with it, though. Uh, we can't put the rosary, like, there, which I thought was clever. Can't put it there. Can't put it in the hole in the wall. Can't do anything with this rosary. No, okay. What about the hammer? Can I hammer that? Wait a minute, no. Hammer that thing there, no. Hammer there, no. Hmm. Damn. 
Well then. Can I use the rosary on the window? If I shake it like the cat. Oh, I opened the window. Wait, that did- wait, that worked! What did I do? I, I lost my rosary. I, I did I use the rosary to open the window? I thought that if I shook if I shook the rosary at the window, that maybe I would make the cat come or something. And now the rosary's gone. I'm gonna I'm gonna say that's intentional. So I need food, wet cloth in the bowl. No, I thought if I could put water for the cat or something. So we could choose some food of some sort. Maybe I can like throw this wet cloth at the birds. Oh yeah, what's down here? Is that no no? Is there anything new down here? Let's see. Let's have a let's have a quick peek. Down in the lovely sewers. God, aren't they great? Alright, we've got some logs here. Can we uh hammer the logs? No. Okay, and we've got the uh the boiler. Can we hammer the boiler? No. We cannot hammer the boiler. Wet cloth? No. Can I wet cloth the boiler? No. I cannot wet cloth the boiler. In case anyone's sitting there thinking, Nalzi, you need to wet cloth the boiler. Uh, uh you're wrong uh, on that one. But thanks for the tip. Good advice. Um, thanks for stopping by. I uh, hope you enjoy the video and you subscribe for more wet cloth on boiler action. Um, so, what do we do here then? What do we do here? Uh, not in there. Is this the one? Is this the maid's room? No, I want to go into the, the maid's place. Where is it again? I forgot. Is it? No, it's not in there. Where is it? Is it over here? Not that one. Is it that one? Yes. No, it is this one. I don't want to go in there. Where do I want to go? What did I want to do with the cloth again? I was, I was trying to do something with the cloth. The birds! I want to go and see if I can scare the, the birds with the cloth. Right, it's not that one. It's the other one. Okay, I'm going to go and throw the cloth and the hammer at the birds. The dogs outside are barking, so I know this is the idea. This is the right one. Alright, you birds, enough of it. Knock it off. I don't know why you're inside the house. This is not a house for birds. Flipping Nora. The things I gotta deal with. Right, I'm going outside. Alright, birds. Prepare to get wet clothed. Oh, wait, they've left the thing. What? Is that a dying bird? Oh, give me it. Oh, ugh. okay. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this, right, in the little basket thing. Yeah, calm down, dying crow, mate, please, you know, come on, mate. Uh, right, it's that room, right? I'm going to put it in there and give it to the bird. I uh, give it to the cat. <laughs> give it to the bird. Okay, I've laid the crow in the bowl. And now what? Do you hear a cat? Cat, come and get this food! Surely this is a prime specimen. I'm gonna go out and then kinda come back in. Cat, catch the cat in the axe. No, what? I thought that was genius. Right, hold on, I'm gonna read the note. And then don't have the clue. Okay, what's going on with him? Luckily, I found a place to hide my rosary. I cannot pray for Nate, blah, blah, blah. Uh, what would, he ordered us to kill him, but still, I cannot let that both thing starve. He's such a clever cat. Every time I open the window, he knows food is waiting for him. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, there is food waiting for you, Mr. Bloody Cat. If you'd want to... Wait, do I have to kill the... No, okay. That would have been pretty dark. Well, there's just a dying crow there now. I don't know what to do here. Uh, do I have to just come back to that room? Ah! It sounds like a lament. I heard something in the distance. Oh, where did the crow go? Did it perhaps go, uh, into that hole? The tiny dark hole in the wall. Uh, well, I can see the blood trail uh, going into this hole in the wall, so I'm going to assume that the crow went in there. Uh, along with the cat. Come out, cat! Are you kidding me? The crow's gone. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> no, thanks for the goddamn heads up on the uh, location of the crow. Uh, okay, so I can't go in there. Okay, why is this cat so spooky? Oh, I can hear meowing. Ah, sound is louder down here. Mr. Kitten? Mr. Cat? Mr. Kit Cat? Kit Cat Paddy Whack, give the cat a crow? Hello? The cat seems to be behind this wall! I can help him! 
Yes! That's what the hammer was for. I was hoping that's what it was for and not something more devious. A black cat is staring at me, but wait, its eyes are missing! Oh god, poor thing. Good lord, it almost lurked my eyes out. It's run away into the dark. Okay, let's go. Wait a minute, what's that? There's an open chest with a dark cloak, a mask, and a knife. Okay, well, let's take that. The knife could be useful. Well, it could all be useful. There's nothing else useful. I'll decide what's useful. Take the mask and the cloak. We'll recreate Phantom of the Opera later. It'll be awesome. Uh, right, so we've got a knife. What are we going to use a knife for? Could we pry open that hatch with a knife? I don't know. That's a long shot. I said we needed a key. What else would we use the knife for, though? A knife. Let's go back in here. Um, so we've done this room pretty much, I think. I'm happy with this room. But what else is left? A knife. What can I use a knife for? Can I... Can I oh, wait. All the crows have gone. Huh. Turn the uh, thing back on. I would better leave it alone, yeah. Okay, fair play. Fair play. All this stuff here, I can't do anything with. The curtains are drawn. Uh, knife the curtains. No. Okay. Bro, fine, fine. Right, let's have a look at the rest of the house. Now that those crows are gone, things have changed. I'm going to go and see what's around the back of the house, actually. So we've just got a blood stain. What's through here? Nada. Wait, a knife? Can I accompany it with a fork? Make a fork knife combo? No. Wait, can I return the knife to where it is meant to be? Plates and pans. Where's the cutlery go? This kitchen's a nightmare, actually, in all honesty. Where the hell is this cutlery supposed to go? No wonder the plate's left out. You don't know where things go. Right. Okay, let's go this way. I'm going to go to the other side of the house now. See what awaits us. In the darkness! Hmm. Hopefully it's good things. Wait, this... Stuck, it won't open. Knife it! Cannot force a lock with a knife. Uh, excuse me, I'm pretty sure you can. I don't think you're trying hard enough. What's down this way? Let's go in here. And try and force this lock with a knife. Wait, can I cut the cat? Oh my god, if that works, if there's something inside it. Oh my god, I knew it! I managed to get inside Lynx's mouth. There's a golden key, of course there is. A madman like Anthony would put a key in a cat's mouth, of course he would. Okay, I've got the key. Don't go down the ladder, what is this? Snakes and ladders here? I've got the key, you fool, get up there. Okay, what's upstairs? Oh, this is where... Yeah, this. Oh god, no. Anthony, no! Anthony! He's fine. The lifeless body of my dear friend. What madness could have led him to commit such an act? There's something in his pocket. We'll take it then. It's a sealed letter. Dear J. Devitt, If you're reading these lines, then I'm nothing but a dead body hanging before you. I write to you in my last shreds of lucidity. You are one of my oldest friends, and when I sent you the letter asking you to come here, I did not doubt for one moment that you would. Had you failed me this evening, everything would have been lost. I have found myself involved in a series of horrible incidents. For reasons beyond my comprehension and sanity, I have become a total stranger to myself and to my closest relatives, capable of the most indescribable and atrocious acts. I cannot give you any more details at this time. I must ask that you go immediately back to the boarding school where we made that pact, where we all swore on our honour that that sentence would protect us. This letter must not reach anyone else, so it is imperative that you destroy it immediately. The lives of the rest of the group, and yours too, are in great danger. Do not delay. They are already waiting for you. Seeing is believing, Divot. Do not forget it. Always your loyal friend, Anthony Beechworth. Oh sweet Jesus! The crows have gone! They have made quick work of him. I'll tell you right now. They're all over him. They're having a good peck there. Uh, it was it was like a Pixar short in there. Uh, wow. Well, there we go. The achievement, don't leave me hanging. Uh, <laughs> okay. 
The last door, the letter, was funded by uh, 285 backers on Kickstarter. Good job. And the adventure will continue in episode two, so join me there. Thanks for watching, everyone. I've been Nalzi. You've been fantastic. If you're enjoying The Last Door and you want to see more, then don't forget that you can rate the video below. And if you have any comments, feel free to drop them. I'll catch you all next time, where we'll continue episode two. See you later, folks. Bye. This is my outro song so that the vid doesn't end too who suddenly. Be sure to click like and fave and drop a comment if you think that you want to. Oh, oh and there's tons of other stuff for you to click in the in the background for you. So go out, go ahead and do that. Thanks for watching the vid, you beautiful people. That is all for now, be sure to subscribe and I'll catch you all later. Oh god, bye. Seriously, why are you still watching this? Go and subscribe and drop a comment below. God damn you, stop watching video. Click fave, drop a comment, I think you want to, but if you don't, well that's your opinion, I guess.